Hey guys, I'm back with a new video. So in today's video, I'm going to be showing you how to make a glitch effect. So this will help your game look cooler and much better. So let's do this. So um, I have a simple text label inside a screen GUI under starter GUI. Yeah, it's nothing special. So I'm I'm going to leave a link in the description for this dev form where they will give you a a model which you should uh, download. You can just install it. So uh, once you install it, uh, um, you're gonna have it inside your toolbox. So just click on it. If you can't find it, make sure you go to this. Oops, sorry. Um. So once you get that, this will pop up in the workspace. So what you're gonna do is drag it into replicated storage. So now uh, we need to make the glitch effect. So what I'm gonna do is go to text label. I put a local script. So first we need to require the module inside this which is called glitch text so to get that we need replicated storage so I'm just getting that real quick and now we need the text glitcher which is the folder which contains the module so uh, oops sorry and now we need the glitch text module so I'll just get it whenever you're getting a module make sure you uh, say require oops and uh, then then get it so uh, let's see here okay glitch text so once you get this uh, so what you're gonna do is now you need to set up the uh, settings for it so what you're gonna do for that is uh, basically say I don't know uh, glitch tween equals to glitch text we're gonna get the module here and say dot um, new in simple simple letters and inside this brackets uh, we're gonna give all the settings so I'm just gonna give it to enter so the first thing you need is uh, the text you want so I'm gonna just say uh, hey subscribe uh, subscribe to its menu and make sure you like this video I need subs and need to complete. Okay, that's enough. Since I need uh, attention. Okay, so once you do that, so this is basically going to be the text you need you want to change to. And uh, then I'm going to put a comma here, and the next thing we need is what we're going to change so we're going to change this text label so we just say script appearance since uh, this script is literally the child of this text label so once you do that um just put a comma again uh, so and uh, make sure say anything which has a text property yeah, so uh, this uh, module will pretty much uh, update anything which has a text property. Uh, the what I mean by text is whenever you go to text label under under the properties panel, there's something called text. If that is there, then it will work. And then the next thing you need is uh, um, tween info. So for all of that, we need to open a squiggly bracket and again put some enters there so first tween info equals to tween info dot new and this way you're going to do it so first thing is how s how fast the animation is going to be so i'm going to make it one second because it's pretty much good it'll look cooler if it's faster and then put a comma and this is going to be called reversed uh, what reversed is is um if you want it uh, if you want the glitch effect to start from the last letter then uh, make it true if you want it to start from the first and go to last then make it false so false is much better and then uh, something called nice no let me just check here uh, single hash so what single hash is basically uh, it's like the glitch effect if uh, you want the glitch effect to happen on each text 
one by one then uh, make it false if you want it to suddenly happen on the whole text then put it to true so once you do those just come back to the last parameter here I mean the bracket and just say glitch text so this will pretty much glitch the text make sure you do it right next to it uh, if you're doing this uh, you can actually remove this but if you do if you want to do this and keep it for later use then just wait five seconds and glitch tween and just do this oops my bad okay so this will pretty much work um, but this is gonna be really messy so I just recommend uh, forgetting this and just put glitch text over here so it will just keep it much more cleaner so we're gonna wait five seconds and I'm gonna actually copy this whole thing paste it again wait five seconds and say something else hope you enjoy and this helps you ha 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 I got free robux okay let's see if it works okay so let's wait five seconds as you can see the glitch effect uh, happened and let's wait five more seconds and that worked too so if you want it to be more slower then uh, change uh, this let's just see how it is five seconds and uh, let's put the reverse to uh, true so it will come from the back I think it's gonna be really slow as you can see it's coming really slow as you saw it worked fine there you go I'll even uh, show you all the single hash so I'll just I'll just make this three seconds and put this to true as you saw it was already glitched and it just uh, made the pathway but this it's like it's glitching the text and showing it it's really hard to explain it y'all can just uh, notice the difference yeah so that's how you do it hope this video helped y'all um yeah see you